everyone. Welcome back or welcome to the channel. I'm Brie. And I'm Tori. Today we are here for more 17 Japanese discography. We've got two... It's here. Really big songs today. Very highly anticipated songs today. Fallen Flower and I'm assuming 24 Hours. 24 ha. 24 ha. What do you, what do you It's just up? an H. There's no ha. 24 ha. 24 24 <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we could spend all day on this. We are here for both of those songs. So we will be doing what we usually do. We will watch the lyric video first from 17 Lyrics. We will watch the music video after that. And then, of course, we will do the choreography video. Um, you guys did not hold back in your anticipation and excitement for both of these songs. And I admit to not only being excited, but also very nervous. I think for a while we've both been talking about <laughs> I'm prepared because I know um, we both been talking about like when we were wanting to get to this video we were like oh they're so excited so we're so excited so we're finally here so we've got fallen fallen flower 24 hours Ooh, Again, fallen flower 24 hour I almost said fallen hours what's anyway. gonna happen today anyway now okay. that my cat has <laughs> he left from my I was because I was lame departed from <laughs> this couch he left because I was lame <laughs> We're going to go ahead and get into it. So. That was it. That was all he had to do. And then he left. So. We're going to start with Fallen Flower. We're going to start with the lyric video. These pictures look very delicate and very gorgeous. Little and flower. pretty with like yeah, all the little petal pieces. So. No idea what we're getting into. Let's go. Already the layered vocals is so full. Stop because I have, a, I have a feeling it's about to get really pretty, but there was just so much happening going back and forth. Oh no, this song is no. It's so very full and it's rich. very full. Like, I could listen to just the background and not listen to the vocals, or I could do either yeah. or. You Thank you. 
That was like the perfect drop with June's voice. Tired. I am tired of these songs being sleep. so good. Oh yeah, I'm tired of it. No, you're not. No, I'm not. Yeah. Oh, s- I did like that one. The line where it talked about dancing and swaying because the way they said it almost sounded like you were like a like a leaf in the breeze, <laughs> just like in the breeze. The way they sang it. Um, those lyrics yet again, so pretty. I'm assuming fan song again, maybe. I don't know. I, I did feel very much like whoever was speaking was, it, it seemed like a lot of like hesitancy and struggles in the beginning of just like using the word falling to kind of describe like, I guess something more negative, I guess like more like a withering flower and something that's falling down. And then it's like it found this beauty, this light and show that you can grow out of times that are tough and mm-hmm. you can find love and, and beauty and, and light things. And you can turn that word falling as in like falling down into like falling for something. And so it kind of turned it from something that can be like more negative to a more positive like connotation. I wasn't even there yet, but yes. Oh. I just meant they seemed, yes, 100%. Oh. That's where I was going yes, to. I didn't, that. let me clarify. I didn't mean as uh, this was just a fan song for the fans. I oh, meant yeah, as yeah. in the person that it seemed like in the the very end that they were talking about because they were talking about how they wish they could have been someone's everything or they missed this person and it had been a while. I saw this came out like four years ago. I mean, it's like. I love the part that they said, like, that you could love somebody like me. Like, I'm not yeah. perfect and you still choose to love me. And so that's when I kind of wondered if it was, if it had to go with that too. Yeah. So I feel like they could have been talking to Carrot as well in some of the song. Uh, I agree with it. Like, everything that you said, because there, there's even that line at the end where they're talking about even with the scar, something beautiful will bloom from like it. the sprouts. Yeah. I love, I loved that imagery of just, like here's this crack, this fissure technically, mm-hmm. and then something can still come up out of it and grow, and, and grow, grow. from something so painful, painful. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. so like you said, once again, the lyrics just absolutely beautiful. I do wonder if it was meant to be toward carrot. Mm-hmm. Um, you don't want to say that for every song with the same time. Like I mean, there's a quite a few, there's quite a few and they do it a lot on obviously on purpose because they love their fans so much. And so, don't want to discredit that if that is the case um, because that's absolutely beautiful. But regardless, the lyrics themselves were so warming and very uplifting. And it just, it really did feel like we started out kind of like struggling a bit more mm-hmm. and it got brighter and brighter as we went on. And I really enjoyed that. I enjoyed the feeling that the song gave me. Less, it was so gorgeous. Less just falling and more falling towards you. Yeah. Like falling down to despair, more like falling towards happiness, falling towards love yeah. and something to dedicate like your happiness too. So <sighs> why do they keep doing this to me? Okay, so now we've got the actual music video. Oh jeez. Oh it looks oh, pretty. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, we're falling. Okay. Are we upside I'm falling. down? I'm falling in love. You're you're you falling. You're already there. I know. Ooh. Like a desert. The sun. Chains. Oh. Sir. I'm trying to be, I'm trying to look at the aesthetics, please. Please, please. (laughs) 
Not you, them. Ming Hao straight taking me out. <laughs> connected to each other? Window? Oh no. <laughs> thought it was a window. It was just like, maybe it was supposed to be. A, I don't know. It just looked like <laughs> where he went through the canvas. I'm so sorry. There's so much happening. There's so much happening. His painting has the the face is all is gone. There were like busts all around. Um, Look at they're all broken. <clears throat> it's a lot of depictions of art as well. Oh. Mm. Oh, wow. lights around them. Petals are going up. Well, that was just gorgeous. Like visually, I think I was just in awe, like almost the entire way through. Like the struggle. Oh God, it was so pretty. Like, I don't mean that in a mean way, but like the way they depicted it and like each frame was so freaking gorgeous. Like you said, all the all of the different versions of like art, art, and they had, all these lights were out before, and I don't know if they're. I thought they were like little planets or moons, but they look kind of similar to the lights at the end that were actually on. And the visuals of this got me. Got me. They got me good. They do, I feel like, I see like a pattern with Seventeen, they do a lot of like MVs that are like the conceptual, like they're in rooms that are separate from each other and those rooms have like different meanings or similar or whatever. You see a lot of that, like it's just kind of cool how their MVs sometimes do that. And they did that like really, really well here. 
And it just, but they were all kind of connected because it almost seems like if something would happen, it kind of affected or it, it like was some similar to the other a similar room. tie to something, right? To, or another, yeah, to another place. Like I said, at some point, uh, who was uh, Mihao was who was he dancing with? Hoshi a lot at, at one point, and like one of them was in black and one of them was in white. Mm-hmm. I thought that was just like the the like the picture that they were just. There was a, I could just watch this again. I'm already like getting back into it. There was a lot of uh, of opposites, like juxtaposition. I think yeah. like, there was the black and white. We had a lot of like with the the um, imagery on their hands. There would be a band aid, but underneath the band aid mm-hmm. were the flowers. flowers. And so obviously, band aid assume in, injury. But then there's the flowers of the blooming, the life underneath, um, the beautiful um, effect of what's happening. I also had. Um, them wearing these very delicate, nice, lace, almost like, not lace, like they were sometimes lace, but mainly like silk like outfits, the silk, yeah. but then extreme messiness, like with the paint or things mm-hmm. shattered all over the floor. And so you did have a lot of, um, a lot of dark with lighter things like going here, on. You got the desert and then above it was like, they're like the flowers. Yes. All yeah. That, the greenery. Well, and I feel like that's what they were trying to, trying mm-hmm. to reach was that, you know, um, and I liked the change at the end of the flowers going up instead of them constantly falling down. Uh, and like here with the broken glass, just everything just felt like there was a mix of the beauty and the pain. Of course, you had the thorns on the hands as well. But then being able to like move past that pain and join yeah. hands with someone who's similar to you in that way. It looked like he blo- they bloom right here in mm-hmm. this dance move. God, just I every know. single second, look. and the, the black, look black on and white face again. Look on Wonu's face. I f- wait. Was that the seven? What the ring? Mm-hmm. Is that, is that is that the ring? I'm not sure. They look very similar, so I'm I'm gonna guess maybe so. But um, so then again, I don't know if this is like we anticipated a song for carrot, a song for each other. I, yeah. They do that a lot, and I absolutely love that about them. Almost like sometimes you can't even tell because their love for each other and their fans is just so interwoven. Well, it's almost like they were giving you like it's almost like they found just going off the video alone. If we didn't know the lyrics, it almost seemed like they they found each other, and with them finding one another, it kind of like helped like helped them that, bloom. Yeah, mm-hmm. and then from that we end up. Where I would think it was them looking around almost on like a stage type type uh, setting. Them kind of just, look, I don't know, they look very fond. They also look extremely like ethereal. Like my goodness, they look gorgeous. How many are there? How many are there? 10, 11, 13. Uh, so now I just feel like it's the song about them, like for the members. I had to double check. That's why my head was doing this. I yes, was there, yeah. 13. <laughs> look, this even looks like the sun on the ground. It looks so cool that. Image. So then look, there's 13 lights. And they are no stranger to just visual, being so visually stunning and just like making you, it's really overwhelming sometimes to sit here and like think of things to say because all you want to do is, because that's all I want to do the whole time with my mouth is wide I don't know open. I you did, but that, yes. That. that. That's what I wanted to do the whole time. And then I was like, oh, wait, I have to think thoughts. That's scary. <sighs> this exceptionally well. They did this. Oh, I can't even explain it, but I know you guys get it. So I want to see that little shoulder move again. Oh yeah, me too. Little. Okay. They're all like little pieces, little cogs of a. Oh, you know what? I was gonna say they're like little cogs of a of a machine, very well. They they look like a flower, like it like the tears and then it's the bloom right of the here. flower how it yeah. opens and exactly. Let me start over. It's exactly what I was saying. There's nothing I love more than a staggered release. <laughs> how pretty. Whoa, the way Minghao slid. Watch his feet. Thank you. 
in sync. So pretty. Oh. oh. It's almost like he grew and then withered, huh? Before we I'm so sorry, Vernon. <laughs> sorry. Anyway, I got off a bit. Um I was dwelling on this thought that I don't know that I that I feel like I gave DK enough credit for that oh. part of his vocals. Um, that's partially because it just became part of my blood and my DNA at that point. Like, I, it just became part I of me. fused and became one I with me. Don't feel like I said anything of it because it just became part of my body. So, um, it's stunning. I just had to say that because then I started thinking, I don't think I said enough about that. And I feel like I should have. So. That part in the music video where he got that little part, it was just, mm, mm, I don't want to the part where the lights were off and he was alone. I said, it's my eclipse. I was thinking the same thing. I was should like, I hey, we just watched that eclipse. Classes. We should, we should. Can you when see? When looking it? at 17. <laughs> the breath like, they take. Oh, I thought they snipped like the flower, you know? <laughs> Roses. But you are right, it's like they take a breath. Oh, there it is. Oh, I love it. Oh, God. I thought we slowed it down. What happened? Oh, there it is. Oh, it is so sick. Yeah, they like... Choreography to me solidified the idea that, like, with this song especially, that they cannot work without one another because mm -hmm. there's. So I said they're like a well, like a cog, like without without a piece. It was almost like oh, this must be the part I was talking about in the music video. So it must have been John when he was dancing with, and they were black and black. And yeah, white I know he was dancing with Hoshi in the beginning. So. Like, I just felt like when I was watching that music video, I was not like I was just watching like art. I wasn't like taking in like who. No, doing I'm telling what. you, I wanted to just go. <laughs> I think I did. The whole, the whole time. Um, but like I was saying, just yes. that they, if you just removed one member from the dance or from like this choreography, that there was a missing piece. And you could see that not just with this like spiral here, but this was like the central one, central one. Um, but so many different times that they, they kind of just fed off of each other's movements. And I really liked that a lot. It's a double. I was wondering why. I was looking at that earlier. I was like, why are there two? Um, I just, the like, the choreo, all, all the choreo to me basically followed that first, like, you know, first, 
I don't know, the first move that they did was the bloom. Where, yeah, the bloom and then the wither. Like that's I feel like that's all they were doing the entire mm-hmm. way through was like they would constantly like open up and then come back down. And like they constantly did this formation or similar formations where it did seem like they were blooming and then withering. I don't know. It was really pretty. It was really interesting the way they would just like open up and then like close back in on themselves. Okay, we still have another song. Oh, so yeah, let's that's right. Move to that one. We're going to do the lyrics first again. It's a demo game it up. Well, you know what? Who's that? It's a demo game it up. So bad. Oh, <laughs> I don't know who he think coming in my ear like that. Like he's just like. Bruh, bruh, bruh. I just want everybody to say excuse you, S Coops. That's what I would like to say. Thank you. Okay. That guitar. Ooh. It's rhythmic. I like it. Mm. <sighs> Came in there higher than a dog whistle. <laughs> I almost didn't even hear it. <laughs> it was so high. Oh, why'd it get dirty all of a sudden? Uh Uh-uh, I don't like it. I love it. Excuse me. I'm going back. I would like to hear that again. The wine on it. mm. I'm going back. I want to hear that again. I feel like a bad bee all of a sudden. satisfying it does something to my brain there are two songs in one There's, 
I'm oh, sorry. I want to hear that last note one more time, just because of the way like it, they held it and just like kind of made it echo. But I think if they're, I'll never mind. I was going to say something about us dancing and bobbing our heads, but I lost my thought because all I wanted to do was hear that note again. Um, so I'm going to do that. How to know, I don't know what that was. I, how to know that Tori don't and Brie like a song. All we do is <laughs> the whole time. We don't even like pause or go back because you just want, you want to keep moving. So this is the dilemma that I always have. I want to pause and go back and hear everything probably about 15 <laughs> times. Like I could sit here and just press like the back key, like over and over and just hear the vocals, hear the rap over and over and over again because it's so gorgeous and satisfying every single thing that they do. But at the same time, all I want to do is dance and bop to the song. And so I don't want to stop it because then I feel like I'm interrupting it. And then I get caught in this like dilemma. And this time the dancey one, because all I wanted to do was this. I just want to dance. I just want to dance. <sighs> How are you feeling about that one? From the head bops, I'm going to guess you, you were uh, all there with me too. I thought there was two songs, but at the very end, I feel like there was a third song that was introduced. <laughs> but they were so seamless. Like It was not. I there was it. a moment where you were like, wait, what? But I it know. wasn't as in like a, a whole shift of like everything in the instrumentation change. It just kind of like shifted the, ryth- like the rhythm of it or the vibe of it. But there are songs where it's like almost everything in the instrumentation changes, which can totally work. But this one, it just like all of a sudden it would like shift slightly and you're like, whoa. No, I'm here. And now I'm back to here. <laughs> um, I'm just curious because I know that this one was about three years ago. So I'm wondering if this one came from like COVID. Because it felt like to me that they're separated and they want to see this. There was one word that I had when I thought this whole thing. Not the whole thing but a similar thing. or I was thinking the word inseparable. They want yeah. to not be separated from this other like, I don't know, individual or just into tea. They're going to think exactly. about you for 24 hours straight, okay? <laughs> I'm really glad it was 24 hours because if not, I couldn't think of another meeting for that title and I was like, 24 H, you know? Um, but yes, I agree with you. Like, they do not want to be separated. They want to always be together. And so I kept just thinking inseparable, inseparable. I like that they talked about how even if you're given eternity with each other, that's not enough. You guys will have to tell us if Tori's prediction of oh. that timing of it is is accurate or if it just was like coincidence. I am really curious about that because I didn't even think about that specific piece of it. Um, are they, cause they talked about time a lot. That's why. Mm -hmm. Cause they talked about, that's kind of what it gave. That's cause it's almost like, I felt like there was a time when everything just kind of seemed like it was continually going and you're just like, and then, well, you've got the strings of fate. So you're always tied together that even if you're not together in that moment, there is always something there, that red string of fate that's tying you together. So you will end up back together no matter what. Yeah, we'll be able to meet for sure. Always, no matter what. So that, that's we just, always that's, come back to each other. It's it's inseparable. That, this too, when they said time is unfair. That's why it's kind of felt, but I mean, it could be something else. Well, I liked this too, like the word time is unfair, because when you do find that person or that thing that mm. you really love, it's almost suddenly like, now I don't have enough time. Even if yeah, like I spent this. every single second or every moment of every day, it's still not enough. I, I like you so much and I want to be with you so much that like I, I cannot get the, enough. I, I, and yeah. even eternity to me isn't like a fair word. It's not enough. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm scared. I don't like this. Thumbnail. I don't like it. <laughs> like, what are you looking at me for okay. like that? No, wait, we're going to start with... Wait, what's the one? Let's go. Oh, sh- I thought he had no shirt on. I, why did he get up like that? I thought there was just no shirt on underneath. He said, <laughs> ready? He said, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Sir. Hoshi, what a pose. Oh, All right. 
Okay. Okay. That's fine. Mm. None of y'all better play. Put them up. Put them up. Put them oh, up. Oh, a different kind of put them up and put them put, put them away. <laughs> oh, every time you pause, I want to do some like really pretty move. Brought out the guns. He's just like Whoa. interesting. Oh. The color bleeding. fine <laughs> what the hell is that it's fine <laughs> do not press play yeah, i swear if you press play i will bite your hand I press play now i, want to I feel inadequately warned i feel <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean they were telling us we were gonna they, we were warned no we weren't warned no. why but we were warned uh, no i feel inadequately warned What the? Oh. Oh. What? Whoa. There are no rules in this place. Mm -mm. Oh. I was gonna try to imitate that. I can't. We're safe now. Uh. <clears throat> I didn't like that smile. You liked it. That was the problem. <gasps> Why? These outfits. Mm -hmm. Oh, what you doing? Oh, with that red hair. Oh, I know. It looks so good. <laughs> oh, it's that. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Kimate <laughs> 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 Oh, whoa. We're going to talk about how it went straight through S Coops. Like, that was fine. <laughs> like, that was just like a little bloop on the radar. Like, I want want as far away from this music <laughs> video as humanly possible. I I am not. I am not well. Feel like I absorbed about two percent of that. Oh, that was two percent. <laughs> <laughs> oh.
no. Um, I will say visually this one I do aside aside from those visuals, I feel like the other visuals did kind of go over my head a little bit more than with Falling Flower. Um, like just a lot of the representation of a lot of things. I feel like I wasn't quite catching on to it quite like I would have wanted to. There was obviously whatever. What was that darting past them? Like, was it just that, I, that, I feel like the thing that went through S coops and was constantly around them? I feel like it's time. I didn't know if it started out as like something specific though. If it started out as like a bullet that was going through, or if it was just yeah. When did it get introduced? So we had, we we were. I felt like we were denying or, um, the laws of physics quite often. Yeah. In wherever we were, we're walking on water, it's fine. Well, I mean, we're trying to manipulate time and and hold on to time. So, so where did that? I don't know. I was too busy. Uh, I don't them dance. No, There was nothing distracting about this video. Nothing distracting. This gave me like some sort of like weird like laggy time feel as well. When did this little. <sighs> Chrome arrow starts zipping around. Ah, here. It's that okay. I see. No wonder I missed it. I see. It's above them. I didn't look there. It's not looking there. I missed it. Okay. It's this metallic blob. That's what know, I'm going to call like, it. It turns into like. I'm just wondering when it darts forward. Whoa, that's so weird. This transition. I know. It's so that, trippy. Yeah. Hmm. Super mm, trippy. I'm still looking. I'm looking. There it oh, goes. There it goes. Okay. I'm just trying to look anywhere but at directly in the middle of the screen. And then Icon they start walking like on walls, you know? Well, nothing like was making sense, I feel like. Hmm. It, was, it was just like constantly circling them and then it goes like directly like straight at S, S Coops at the end and like just straight through him. This... I don't know. This right here, I feel like it must be like for the, uh, I don't know if it was for, if this is, I don't know if this was a single or if this was on an album, but that's, I feel like this is like the logo for it. And that's why it kind of gave me, I, I feel like it's a time The string thing. of fate, if it was a time mm, loop. Maybe. But I'm just but trying to understand why it went it was, straight through him of, of all of them. I mean, obviously my thought goes duties. to like leader and, you know, the job of, you have to, you know. Regardless, um, I don't know if that's exactly what it was or if that's why that happened, but I was really curious as to why it, it didn't go through like anybody else. It only went through S. Coops. Hello? Mm. Don't look at me that way. Too late. Yeah. This like little, this These little area too. looks almost like it's like a stage. Regardless... His acting, all of their acting, in this part especially, but in both of these videos, as mm. always, just absolutely gorgeous. Like, cinema, like cinematography masterpieces. Ooh. Would they look like they were in, like, a, a clock form? I'm so curious. Okay. You ready? Yep. I was hit in a mini album. Oh, on the ground, though. Yeah. They're line dancing. <laughs> Sorry. They're, they're dancing on the line. <laughs> so, I gotta start over because I was just airing at the floor. <laughs> they're going counterclockwise if this is an accurate... Oh, okay. I know what you've done. I know what you've done too. <laughs> It is satisfying that they're spread out along these, like, this axis of, like, these different, like, because if, if it is, if it is time or a type of clock, it's not, like, a traditional one. It doesn't have, like, all of the, mm -hmm. so I'm, I'm, 
Now, what I'm noticing is that so far when they rotate, they're only going in where how we're sitting is counterclockwise. They're only going mm-hmm. this way mm-hmm. again. I don't know. I if wonder if they'll change it. I was wondering that too. Like it toward like what towards the end, they'll start going the other way. Because they do it here, they all rotate. Yeah. Again. Like a snake. I know. It's so slippery. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. There's 12 of them on the ground. Time yourself. Who are you? There's 12 of them on the ground. What time is it? What time is it? <laughs> what time o'clock is it? <laughs> What 17 o'clock is this? <laughs> Whoa. Imagine if we how told time. It's interesting how he was only manipulating a specific number. Whoa. I'll tell time in 17 members. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Jeez. They almost like broke free of it. Now we're back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're going the other way now. I know we are. Oh, oh. Is he winding it? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no. No. Oh, the swag. Okay, Dino. Oh, this one has such big movements. Whoa, and it moved that way. I really just want to tell time in like 17 members based on their placement. This is now my new watch. Yeah. Get out. Instead of saying like, oh, it's 430, we would say, no, 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 no. (laughs) I'm in need of a new watch. I have none. (laughs) They're in the middle, so it's like, which member do you pick? It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Whatever. Why? I wanted to end the video. Oh. Okay. Okay, final thoughts. Do you have them? Are you putting your watch? Oh, you're putting your watch back on? (laughs) Yes, you do. Well, I didn't suddenly gain a, gain a watch, so I guess I have to use this one until I get my new fancy 17 watch. What are your final thoughts? My final thoughts are that... Wait, this one. Pull the up shirty one. Yes. I got scared. I really thought we were about to, like, regardless, it doesn't matter. It was scary enough. I'm not going to apologize for any of the things that you saw in that video. Honest? If you watched it, you watched it. Thank you. I was going to say, honestly, I feel like we talked a lot, so I don't think there's really much else to say. Yeah. No, I, I genuinely, I feel like we covered everything, and now that my brain has been broken from all of the amazing choreography that I just watched and wish I could comprehend better, but I can't because I don't know dance. Um, I don't know. Yet again, we got two very different, two very different vibes here mm-hmm. going on. I don't know. I felt like we kind of got what, what they were going at for with the dance at least when it comes to time and you catching on to the counterclockwise and then at towards the end it switches to clockwise and then almost just got sporadic like you mentioned like there wasn't it wasn't really it's following almost, an order because well, they like were doing counterclockwise and then they like kind of broke free from it and then once they came back together they started going clockwise it seemed like not to the same extent as it was 
when they were going counterclockwise because they were yeah. constantly moving. But it's almost like I almost wonder if they were trying to get to where they should be, but they're just not able to get there until finally the time has started going again correctly. The metaphors, <sighs> the imagery that they do every single time never fails to just be like, it leaves, leave either of us just like awestruck. So, um, okay. I think that's the end of my final thoughts for today's video. So I'm going to go ahead and end here with this. Hey, you, yes, you. Have you been wanting to watch some really healing content with some ridiculous people, two really ridiculous people who just kind of laugh through the whole thing, but really, really enjoy to heal? If that's you and this resonates with you, come join us on Patreon to watch 17 in the Soup season one, because that's what we started this week. If you're sold, we'll see you Five there. Five ninety-nine. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> We will give For you a one time no. payment of one time payment of fifty nine ninety nine. No, we'll lower it fifty nine forty nine. <laughs> anyway, I had to do that. It's been it in my head. It sounded like an infomercial. I, I was like, where did we just cut to commercial? It's been in my head for like two days and I had to get it out. I'm so sorry. Regardless, that is what we're doing on Patreon. If you are able to or want to join us over there, if not, thank you for being here. Thank you for watching this video with us. We love you so much and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.